So if you have watched the other videos on this playlist, you know that the lithosphere is divided into separate sections called tectonic plates. Tectonic plates are separate divisions of the lithosphere that float freely on the asthenosphere. This video will discuss the different types of tectonic plates and how they move around the Earth. There are seven major tectonic plates and six smaller ones. The largest tectonic plate is the Pacific Plate. Look closely at this picture. Often, the edges of plates make up the edge of a continent, and the plates themselves are often named after the continents they make up. As I said before, the solid tectonic plates float on top of the semi-liquid mantle. The mantle is liquid enough to flow and move around. The center of the Earth is hotter, so the lower portions of the mantle are hot, and the upper portions are cool. This uneven heating causes convection cycles in the mantle. Magma heats up in the lower portion of the mantle, rises, and cools down at the top and sinks. These convection cycles are what pushes the tectonic plates around, since the tectonic plates are floating on top of these cycles. There are actually two types of tectonic plates, continental and oceanic. Oceanic plates are thinner and made up of recently cooled magma that has risen to the surface and turned into rock. These plates are made up of newer rock and they're mostly covered by oceans. Continental plates are thicker and made up of older rock. They're mostly covered by land masses. That's all for now. Watch the plate boundaries video to learn about what happens along the border of these tectonic plates.